John Bollinger with Premier Guitar. Today we're doing a review demo of the Boss Acoustic Singer live. And as you might have guessed from this, this is a tiny little amp made for a live application of acoustic music. I'll tell you all about it after I tell you about how we're recording it. Um, this is my Cole Clark guitar. I'm just running straight in. Uh, and then I'm also using a, a Shure SM7 in the mic setting. Um, we're running, there's a direct out for the vocal, and there's a second direct out for the guitar. So we're getting direct on both those. Um, we've also mic'd the front, uh, just in case you want to hear that. But the money, I think, is using this as a preamp and sending it direct. So those are the basics, Now I wanted to tell you all about it. So here's the basic details. This is a 60-watt biamp amp that combines a 6.5 inch woofer with a tweeter, something they call a dome tweeter, don't exactly know what that is, but dome tweeter and a woofer together. Two different channels, right down here is the acoustic, well, guitar setting, but we can put a mandolin in if we like, which I'll do a little bit later on. Um, and here's some cool little bits on it. Okay, you've got volume, bass, middle, treble, which I'm running all flat. There's this anti-feedback notch, if that's your jam, you can do that as well. And then built-in effects. The effects are, you've got reverb and you've got chorusing. I'm not a huge fan of chorusing, but why don't we go ahead and hear a little bit, see what it does. But that's just straight in with the verb. And man, the verb is pretty lush. Now, if you're one of those chorus weirdos, let's try it. Cool, that's one type. Let's bring you to this other type. A little more pronounced over here. Okay, I can see where that would come in handy, if that's your thing. That's cool. Um, but again, the verb is more of my thing and goes from subtle to extreme. I 
mean, that is just fun, right? But I would probably keep it a little more conservative around there. Anyway, in the room, it sounds killer. Uh, right here is a quick setting. If you want to take off that tweeter, you can just mute it as you go, which is pretty cool. Bring it in and out at will. So the looper, which I used on the way in, works great. And I was triggering it with my foot, just uh, plugging in this boss pedal. And here's a sideline. Um, Boss, you should really include this with the purchase of the amp. This you have to buy separately right now. But most amplifiers, when you buy them, say a, you know, say a, a, a boogie or a Fender or a or a or a you know PV whatever, they usually throw in the foot control, and this isn't thrown in. But you're going to absolutely want it because that's how you control this looper, and the looper works great. So you just start your little, you know, well, you know how it works. I play on the way in, but. Add over there. So you got the idea, fun to play with. In fact, I could get lost playing with that for hours. I have, uh, but that's a quick demonstration of it. That covers the guitar channel. Actually, it doesn't cover it. Let's go ahead and try a mandolin in it so you can see what that sounds like. Still, EQ is flat. Let's see what it does. Come on, man, that sounds very mandolin-y to me. Come on, man. And that's just, I mean, that's not even jacking with it. That's just plugging straight in. Sounds great. Okay, I think we've covered this channel. Let's talk about this happy fellow up here. Now you've got the option of running a, an XLR or a quarter inch into it. Um, there's phantom power switch right there. There's a pad if you need it. Very cool mic settings. Um, the rest is the same up to this point. Volume, bass, middle, treble, which I all had flat. Um, Anti-feedback, which I wasn't using, but if that's your bag, great to have for an immediate fix on a gig when you're being tortured by feedback issues. Uh, up here, you have some cool effects, which I can show you. Well, hell, I'll show you on the microphone. Here we go. You've got a slapback delay. Hello? 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 So it goes from what they say is delay to echo, but a cool setting to have, should you want it. Um, now this is where it really gets fun. Well, actually, next you have reverb. Handy to have. Cool, right? Want to get real wet? I'm down in the well. Hello? 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 Cool, pretty standard, but over here, this is the harmony thing. And I thought that was cool as could be. So, you know, like we were just doing. Uh, actually, let me get back on guitar and I'll show you a little bit on that. Okay, so I'm back on guitar. Right here, you can turn this on and off with your con foot control, which again, Come on, man, throw in a couple foot controls. Not gonna kill you, and it's really handy to have. So I've got a boss foot control right there, and you can turn them on at will, So, which is great. So like I was doing right there, 
16 tons. So you got your high harmony right there. Now say you want to have a unison. 16 tons. 16 tons. Or this low guy right here. 16 tons. So very cool uh, options to have right there. And you can affect or you can control the level of that harmony, whatever you want it. So, I mean, for a solo coffee house type gig, this is really cool. Great thing I, I, about it, you know, a lot of times in, in situations like there, that there is a PA, but monitors can be kind of glitchy or whatever. So you can come in with this have this as your stage monitor, send a little bit to the audience, and then send your direct outs to the crowd, and man, you're covered. You've got your whole enchilada right there. And most importantly, you have a comfort factor, because I find when I do those gigs, it's, they're all different. Every PA is different. The setup always, it's, you don't really have time to dial in your sound, because it's usually kind of a throw and go. So this is great. You can have your thing all worked out, walk on stage, and have loops and harmonies and <laughs> chorusing and echo and reverb and all that jazz right there uh, and control it with your feet as you go. Very hip piece of gear right here. So those are the basic deets on the Boss Acoustic Singer Live. <laughs> to read the full written review, go to premierguitar.com. Also, while you're, while you're online, make sure you like us on Facebook. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check out the lessons on our site. All the other crazy cool crap that's out there. This is John Bolger kicking it old school with some dead. Let's put on some chorus in and reverb and get our full hippie on. <laughs> Got a wife in Chino Bay and one in Cherokee First one says she has my child but he don't look like me Said I'm running but I'm taking my time Friend of the devil is a friend of mine I get home before daylight I might just get some sleep tonight Don't forget to sign up for PG Perks, your all-access pass to exclusive gear giveaways and discounts on PremierGuitar.com.